Hello, welcome back. Last time I tumbled down into a scary cave, got myself trapped, and then had to think my way out of it. Uh, I believe the exit is open now, but my business isn't quite concluded here. First of all, this machine right in front of me, we gotta optimize this. So I reviewed what I did before, and uh, let me just try reproducing the relevant parts of it, minus what doesn't need to be there. So shapes I need are this one, and something similar for B. Nope, oh, that's not optimal movement. Okay, so now I stick these two staples together. Scoop A out with them. Stop moving at the appropriate time. Both? No. Only C, I think, needs to trim down now. B can stay as it is. I'm gonna stick B just, like, here and see if that works. It won't. Okay, let's move B down a bit. Alright, yeah, so here things start getting a little messier than they were. I'm gonna pull things down this far. Get B down there, I guess. Okay, yeah, so things are getting messy. I am definitely out of the realm of optimality right now. So now I'm just hoping there's enough leeway that it doesn't matter too much. So, A chops. C, I think, only needs to lose one more block that belongs to it. I don't like where B is going. I'm gonna move it differently. Let's just shove B over here. That'll be a fine spot. I guess I can trim C before A. Because C needs to move, lose that. Actually, I can sort of do them both at the same time. Let's see. What if this? So that's what I want for A. What I want for C is this. No, 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 uh, yes, actually. And also, this is important. I think that's all the trimming any block needs. So all of these shapes should be compatible with what I need to ultimately do. Let's put this over here first. Shove it up with C. As far as it needs to go. Which is one more. Therefore... no, that's fine. So up. Hook over this way, I think. That looks right to me. Oh, uh, whoops. You need to come down and around. If I had chopped a little piece out of B right there, I could be walking through it here and maybe that would be more optimal. But anyway, that's a solve with how many? 322. And that's all complete. Okay, good enough. Alright, get out the token. Yeah, there was definitely a middle part. I wonder what a perfectly optimized solution there would look like. I'm not gonna get one. But hey, you wanna beat my high score of 322? Be my guest. <laughs> anyway, so, a gate was opened when I first solved that. And here we- oh shoot. <laughs> I fell down again. I fell down again. <laughs> Alright, Inventor Builder, Inventor Builder, Dreamer Dreamer. Can I write that down? Alright, got the full key, both sides of the, uh, both sides of the tablet recorded. Mushroom! I need two more of those for my friend Charlie. Alright, and there's more Silk and Bond. What's this? Sand on the floor. And there's that, and there's- oh, this continues. First of all, I just want to verify that I do have a way to get out of here. No, there is additional activities before that can happen. Okay, so I am still trapped. So this wire needs to light up from there. Okay, so this will get me out. But then there's more stuff to the south. <laughs> I'm huge! Alright. I gotta chop my way out. Oh, this is funny! Chop. And... That may have been a mistake. It's hard to tell, though. Oh, right. Um, wait. If that's all I can chop... Is there more stuff? There's a conveyor, there's a bee... So hold on, how can I chop more? 
I guess by doing that, but then I'm trapped. Oh, this is fascinating. Uh, okay, so I can chop that out. But the places that I chop affect what I can chop in the future. Because of course they do. Okay, well... I got that option. This option. I can do one more of those, but that'll... well, won't kill me. Okay, so that gets me a way out. Maybe that's all I need. Oh, that is all I need. Wait. Complete. There was a bee down there? So that was a weird solution that wasn't all complete, so I think I can I can skip some of the other ch choppings. What do you suppose that bee's about? I don't know, that seems irrelevant. It's way down there. <laughs> uh, okay, so... To be something resembling optimal here... I would do something resembling this. Yeah, okay, so I think that's pretty much optimal. No, that is insufficient. So maybe I can... If I'm supposed to use B... Okay, so ways to use B. I can go here and chop that and get access to... Ooh, I, I can take a piece out of myself there, I don't know if I want to. So why would I do this? This feels so weird. Why would I do any of that? Like, I'm already over the move count that I was after. Okay, um... So 40 was insufficient. Hang on, let me do this again. And just sort of watch what happens. Wait, I can uh, chop like that. Ah, but I get trapped if I do that. Okay, I can chop in from there and I think it's good. So I go this, this way, chop that. This way, chop that. Here we go, this is the way. That seems a little bit quicker. Yeah, okay, I'll complete. I don't know what B is for down there. I didn't need to use it. Okay, cool. So, my way out is open now, I think. Or at least one more gate on the way. Is it actually? Let me see if I have freedom. I'd like to know. Just curious about my status. It is. These caves and mine shafts may be dangerous. It is unknown what lies inside. Enter at your own risk. So yeah, I enter at the risk of uh, getting stuck and not having a way out. Okay, so, uh, you, machine. Ah, got a corner taken out already. Okay, so we're in variation zone here. And presumably I'll have to use B now? I think I understand why. So check it out. If I try to do the same thing I did before, it's going to terminate early. Well, I can chop myself, for one thing. Uh, I can do that. And I can do this. But I can't do the other one, right? Yeah, I just die. Well, so I can take the route I took last time. Let's see if that's good enough for it. I mean, it'll be good enough to clear the puzzle, at least. Ouch. Oh, no. Right. Because, okay, so those always overlap in such a way that if I chop anything... No, wait, what's the implication? Yeah, so I want to be standing on the gate with a block on the switch. And then move somewhere orthogonally to have it chop. Is there... are there any other options for that? Uh... Not 
quite convinced that there are not. But I'm not really immediately seeing one. Okay, so let's cut a notch. And use it to retrieve B. I can do that. I don't know if I want to, but I can. So B will fill in my missing piece, I guess. Ouch! <laughs> ah! Okay. In theory, B will fill in my missing piece someday. Um, and how will I make it do that? Okay, so pull it over and then get to the other side and push it. Okay, so you are up. You fill in my missing piece. Then I can complete the chop I wanted to do here. Can I? Wait, no, how do I... Okay, so maybe I should have chopped that earlier. Before I go for B, let's make this chop. Yeah. Alright, pull all the way. Push a bit. Playing the golem here. Uh, so I want to stand here and move there and get it to chop, but it won't. Of course it won't. Why would it? Yeah, how would B help with that? How would B help with anything? Uh, maybe I can... Uh... Well, maybe I can work with that. Occupied. Yeah, that's a space I can't take out. That's death for me. Here we go. No. Uh, one more? No. I'm still on it. Okay, not sure I understand the principle here. Oh, that did get me sort of out, but B is in the way now. This piece can be chopped off. Uh, somehow. But only by using B that way. Wait, how did I do that? Where's the gate? There it is. How did, how did this work? I moved it up and no, that's not it. How did I chop that block below me? Like, B had to specifically be caught on my... Oh, right, I, uh, I put it in this notch, right? No. Why would that work? I... I did something. Happen. 
I don't know what I did. Uh, I had... So, so I had notches cut out of myself here. Or... Eh. Wait, but how did I take that out? Ah! Uh, okay. So I can do that. I can do that. But I can't do this ever. I'm kind of confused here. What? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start over. I don't know which direction I'm chopping to get out of my block. I know I must get out of my block. B is there and I presume it will be helpful to me. In order to gain access to B, I need to interact with it using a notch on A, and that's the way that I currently know to create the notch. I can deepen the notch if I want to, or I can choose not to. On the way, I can carve that if I desire. How did I carve the one that was up and to the left of where the gate is right now? That happened once, but I don't know how. It involved B, didn't it? Yeah, I push it up and then I ch well, no, that's the same. Can I be one to the right as I do this? Not exactly. Can I be one more to the right? So I put it there and I do... Ah. Wait. Ah. No. Alright, so to carve anything that's around me, what needs to happen? There needs to be a clear space... two up and two to the left of what I want to carve. Two up and two to the left of what I want to carve. Okay, and there is a clear space two up and two to the left of me, and that's not great. I don't know if I want to do this. I don't see how B is helping me yet. So I can do things with it to keep the space not clear for longer, in case I need to put the gate, like, inside a part of... Two up and two to the right. I mean, this is obviously a bad situation. I'm still not convinced I need B, but I just don't understand what I'm trying to do yet. Two up and two to the right. Okay, well there are four choices. The one to my left. Ah, and there needs to be something that is one away orthogonally from that. Something. Okay, so if I took a notch out of my top, how would I do that? I know I did it once. Was this further to the right or something? Okay, so pushing B left was how I chomped that. Hmm. 
I can do it again down here. But I can't do it again here, can I? Not the same way because there is an A block now on the thing. It'd be nice if I could carve that somehow, but I don't see how that would ever happen. Unless... hold on. There's one possible way. So that's closed the gate with me way down here, but I'm too far down. Do I need to carve B? Maybe I need to carve B. Okay, well, I, I carved it. Um, now I can't move it. <sighs> oh, okay, yes I... No, I can't. Uh, I carved it more. Uh... <laughs> oh, this is confusing. I probably need to carve B. That's what I'm thinking. I think all of this stuff with the conveyor and stuff is just... ...so that I have to do things like that to get to B. I'm gonna ignore the rest of my form right now. Pull this o over to here. With I guess here is what I want. So I push it over. You go that way. I push you up. Right, so this is semi-appealing. Doing this setup gets me a partial passage to myself. However, there is a solid block, two up and two left, from the next block I want to carve. Ah, but what if I went from my position up instead of to the right? So I would need to be able to move something off of the switch. <sighs> right there. Wait, hold on. No, 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 I tried to carve this. Right, which should be possible, right? If I do... Uh... I need to carve B. Hold on, am I am I saying that I see the shape I need? Uh, okay, so switch is there. If I went to the right and so was B and... Okay, I think I see the block I'm gonna take out of B. When do I wanna do it? Probably not yet. Now? But it's way up there. Can I... How, how high up can I get? Not high enough to retrieve. Maybe I need to do it earlier. I think that should be possible. I'm not so sure, though. Okay, so carve... Carve I want to block. Block I want to carve is this one. And now you can't move left. So maybe I need two of them. That's also not what I wanted. Ah. Ah. Whoa. That's pretty hard. Uh, I can go here. I think I can get around B now. Here we go. But I've accomplished nothing. Ah, uh, but, no, 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 I've moved it up. That's not what I wanted to carve. There. Okay, so that's what I wanted, but now I can't get in there. Mm-hmm. I cannot get in there because the gate is closed. If I had one more notch... somewhere... how would that happen, though? Uh, 
I don't know. Okay, well there's that. I don't think it helps. I'm pretty sure it does not help. Ah, let's move B differently here. Ugh. I mean, was that block helping me? I don't know. Uh, yes, it was. Okay, I don't understand what I'm doing. There are a lot of potential routes to... something that might look like a solution. I can't tell what actually looks like one, though. So I go here, I move left. No, I go here, I move left. That seems pretty good. I pull this over. Go up one and do it again. And that seems pretty good. Now for the next step. Block to my right has something solid in my prison. Two up and two to the left of it. Block to my up does not. So I want that north block chopped by the gate. A move that I make, moving me onto, okay. So a move that I make, which puts the gate here, needs to, at the same time that I make that move, clear off the switch. Oh, well, isn't that just this? Yes, okay, there we go, there we go, I did it. Okay. Uh, move count is low hundreds, okay. Oh, so uh, let's try try doing that a little better. So that was carve notch here. Use notch to retrieve B. I wonder if there's a quicker way than what I was doing. There might be. But I do kind of want it around me. And that seems like about the best way to do it. So I, I pull it up. Yeah, let me just do what I already did, but better. That. That. And then... It's really just this, isn't it? Uh, no, it's, uh... Shoot, how is it? I did this a moment ago. Is it one more to the right? Yeah, this. Okay. So that's what I just did, but better. 94, still not all complete. Okay, well, getting there. Where was there an inefficiency in that? I do need a notch. That doesn't count as a notch. So quickest way to notch appears to be that. I can sort of go down through here now, which is... So I can't, like, multitask on this. I, I can chomp that without B's help, but it doesn't help me. Oh, that little exit hatch will make things quicker, I think. Yeah, 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 okay. I think I can take advantage of that. So an extra escape hatch on the thing. I did still need the top notch for repositioning B, right? Did I actually? Could I do without that? No, 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 no. So I, I do need this. Then I do that, I believe. Get out of here a little quicker. And then I always lose track of what I'm doing here. Is it that? No. No, it's uh, one more to the right, but but down too. So, so this. Here we go. That's a slightly quicker escape. Ninety-two. I think I had ninety-four before, but that didn't improve things. 
Am I missing a way of doing something, or am I just doing what I'm doing badly? Getting this extra chomp seems good. Do I want to do this move? It feels like it. Okay, so that gets B on the thing at 48. Can I even get it on the thing at all if I go around another way? It doesn't seem like it. Like, I just can't get around it in any way other than this, as far as I can tell. Uh, idea. Bad idea. Right? Yeah, that's way past for act actually it doesn't even go. This appears to be what I want. And there's no way I can skip. Like, I do that, I can't get B back. I need this top notch. Can I skip a st- uh, no, I definitely can't. Not the way I'm thinking about it, at least. If I go left from here, I'm not getting B back. I move it here. I carve this. That might be a quicker exit for me. It's not, that's 92 again. And at this point... Yeah, there's not going to be anything else I can do. That's still 92, right? Yeah. Wait. No, oh, no. Okay, so my inefficiency, wherever it is, is not there. It's somewhere earlier. That extra chop... Did that actually do anything for me? It didn't cost me anything. Could I have done it in a different place that would have been better? Could I have done it in a different place? It happens there. No, that's pretty much where it's going to happen, if it happens. I could go back for another one. Ooh! Oh, doing that early, that's much quicker. Yeah, okay, so doing those two chops early, and I just need B's help for the final one. There we go, that's the way. Okay, so you go to that very special spot. Of... Is it here? Uh... No. It's... How is it? You need to go to the right by one or something? Okay, there we go. Now, has that saved me what I needed to save? Oh, yeah. There we go. All complete. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that was pretty cool. <laughs> All right. Well, this continues. I'm going to take a super quick peek and just see, like, what the nature of what's here is. A blue machine. Gears. And that's probably another machine over there, I think. All right. Well, this just kind of keeps on going. That wire goes to a place I can't get to. It's possible it'll open this door, but I think it might not. It looks like it probably prepares something for later. Okay, so we got sort of the ultimate machine here in this cave. 
and then I dead end and I'll have to leave and this might be this is in the direction of where the castle is noodle maps can't receive a wifi signal uh, down here uh, okay so uh, we'll see what this machine is about and then leave the cave and check the castle next time